guy just got creamed in his tent. It has now been over 24 hours since the incident here at Tent City, and the damage is still very much evident after a truck collided with this fence here and continued on to where allegedly a tent was placed. Now, the driver of this truck allegedly, witnesses tell us here on the scene, dragged this tent with an individual inside down this road about 100 feet. The driver has now been charged. The tent resident remains severely injured. For a guy to be drugged that far, and there must have been a lot of hate and hatred towards that or us or this is the entity. Tyler Grant Manter, born 1992, has been charged with one count of impaired driving causing bodily harm and one count of driving while prohibited, according to court documents. Community advocate Heather Friesen says Sunday's incident highlights the importance of the need for housing. I see even more fear to be unhoused now in the Kelowna population. I see more trauma and I see it having a massive ripple effect with the people who, who do the work to support the people who are unhoused because I'm already getting messages. Well, there's been people targeted, people have been hit by frozen eggs and uh, targeted that way and um, people have been beat up and like you know civilian arrested or whatever you want to call that. And, and I understand there's a lot of theft going on, but that's just it's life. We need every single politician in this city, whether you're federal, provincial or municipal, to start using your platforms to speak out for vulnerable people because this is unacceptable. Manager has a bail hearing scheduled for Monday. For Castanet News, I'm Madison Earhart in Kelowna.